Dynamic Fill is new to Bluebeam 2017. It allows you to highlight a selected area to add markups with greater ease. First, go to the Measure tab at the top of the screen and then click on the Dynamic Fill icon, illustrated by a paint bucket filling a square. Once you've done this, a toolbar will appear at the top of your screen, which displays the various tools within the Dynamic Fill function. Options are also available to change the colour and size of the boundaries marker and the fill. Selecting the Boundaries tool will allow you to close off any unwanted gaps in the area you wish to highlight. Click once to initiate the boundary, then double-click where you want the boundary to end. You can also click across multiple points to create multiple boundaries around one specific section. Using the Shift key will allow you to maintain perfectly angled lines throughout the boundary setting. Following this, select the Fill icon and click and drag your mouse over the area you wish to highlight. If you accidentally fill areas you did not intend on filling, you can always add more boundaries to close off these gaps. Furthermore, if you click on the bin icon, you can clear all boundaries and fills. After this, you can add additional markups and measurements of the area you have selected. Click Apply once you have finished.